So one of the main things we get a lot of people misconstrue that is that three four, right? Can you hear me good, still, Mark? Yep, we got you. So we we got a question here about the traditional. Look, do I need to come up some? We should come up a little bit so that you can. There you go. All right. That traditional nose tackle, right? So what we've gotten to in this game now is that nose is a lot more athletic. So Anthony, he asked earlier about a nose guard, right? So what we want to make sure we get done here is we get a nice space eater up this front. Now, the reason why you need that space eater here is because he can demand double teams. Wherever the running back and the quarterback want to go, they have to demand a double or triple over the nose here. Okay? That's the traditional 3-4, right? But what we're seeing now and what Coach Kevin Steele is going to bring to the table, and now even Coach Charlie Strong is more of a multiplicity out of the, the odd front, okay? So now you can have what we call shades, okay? So we're shading this side here. We'll get a four-eye technique here, and we'll get an edge here, okay, on that outside container. Now, what that brings to the table and what we have to make sure we're doing here is this Mike Backer, okay, let's say, for example, it's a, a read. He can come here or go here. It's up to them, okay, and we're reading this edge rush here. What, you're, what we're finding, a big issue with Miami has been for the longest is once these big guys climb, they get rid of here, and they climb here or they climb here. This is where we were having problems, is that these guys back here get washed up and get caught up in the rift with the big guys up front because Miami traditionally don't have these guys here at 6'4", 330 pounds, at 6'3", 300. So what Coach Kevin still brought to the table, he did this a lot at Auburn, is I'm not going to play your game size-wise so now let's lean into what we do well with speed, with stunts, with twists, okay? With stunts and twists. That's what people aren't getting about how great the 3-4 can be. Let's do the same read option. Let's go over the same play, that same read option off the same alignment, right? Right? Traditionally, Miami's going to get blown off the ball here. What you do to change a lot of that is you start doing stuff like this here. Okay, put my mic here, let's put my wheel here. Creep them up close to the line of scrimmage. We start doing stuff like this. So what I just did there is I slammed my edge. He's coming in to the, to the B gap. I bring my, my four-eye technique. He's swinging over to the A with slant going straight here. We got eyes in the backside B gap. We got contain on the backside for the defensive end, right? But what we're doing here is we're going with the flow of the play on the offensive line, right? But what's going to free it up, because once they see that edge rusher slam down, the QB is going to do what, guys? Once you see the edge rusher slam down, the QB read is going to be what? Keep. Because he's going to see this guy come down. So as soon as he sees that, oh, he going to, you coming down here, you're taking him away. The QB is going to think it's La La Land up the sideline, and then he get hit right in the mouth by the middle linebacker. So we're actually dictating to, dictating to the offense what to do there. Okay. Now, it, it's just saying, like, it's a, it's something simple, okay? Something simple as far as dictating to a, a, an offense, okay? And it's the best way that a lot of coaches have gotten to the point of fixing their issue. Now, again, hopefully you all can see this. It is kind of far away. I'm trying to draw as big as I can on here for you, and I do apologize about my camera quality, but um, wasn't able. I'm not home, as you all can see. All right. 
I'll give you one more play. Now, Coach Charlie Strong, his way of coaching defense is a little different. He was running like a 3-3 stack as a 3-3-5 stack. So he would have, let's say, for example, here. Okay. So he would shade here, backside five, front side five. Okay. You'll see why I say backside and front side in a second here. So backside would be away from the back. Front side would be where the back is standing. Not necessarily where he's going, but where he's standing. Strength, weakness, that kind of stuff, right? So put the mic here. Let's say, for example, if we're stacking, if we're stacking, that means that we would have the linebackers directly behind where the linemen are. This is Coach Charlie Straw while he was at Florida. And the reason why they were so successful, okay, is because – the front guys, these guys here, basically acted as complete double team consumers and allowed the linebackers to flow to wherever the play is. Okay, let's let's do the same. Let's go on a twenty four stretch. Okay, so count out two, four, six, A, B, C. Okay, so you come here. Let's say that the play is, is directly to go behind your right guard. So the traditional blocking set would be this. Cook block, scoop block, okay, cut off block here, cut. Get double team here, and eventually we want to climb here, right? So what does that leave wide open? If if this if the linebackers are dictating to the offense, right? He could show here and mess up the double team. Okay, he can he can come around here. And then if he here, and now this is a zone run here, and he sees all this mesh, where is he going to do? Come right out here. Where are the people? You got a strong side uh, linebacker and a defensive end standing right there. If you cut back, you got pursuit. Okay, so that, that's where a lot of what happens here. Now, that's just them lining up. I'll take you to uh, how aggressive this can get. Okay. Again, just out of simple 10 personnel, um, let's do it out of 11 just so people can see what happens when both these coaches like Coach Kevin Steele and Coach Charlie Strong like to do when it comes to tight ends, per se. All right, so let's put a tight end over here, all right, which would make the strength of the defense to the left automatically here. So let's let's go with who's going to be calling for this Coach Kevin Steele. Now, he said we we're going to be a 4-3 attack defense. So what that means is he's going to have a strong side linebacker address that tight end. Your defensive end is now going to come a little bit closer to more of a, uh, more of a four eye head up here because you don't want to be sitting in the gap. That's just asking to be double teamed. You got a three technique back here. You got a two eye backside. And you got a five here. Okay. You got a mic right there and a wheel right here. Okay. Now I'm going to put it back in the tight end to the same side. So you put them over here. Okay. Now, what you're going to see, what you are going to see is a whole bunch of three technique, B guy. Defensive end, three technique, A guy. Defensive end, B guy. Okay. Nose, traditional take that double team so the wheel can slam back here. And the defensive end is going to keep contained at all times here. What you're doing here, again, is play is going here, right? But this guy stays, we're reading this side, and we're reading this defense in. He stays home. He's going to give, right? Well, the back is going to see all of this cluster, right? Tight end is here, taking this home. Also keeping my open hand free for contain. We're up here twisting up front. So the back is going to be trying to find somewhere to go, right? Well, guess what? My bike linebacker is cross-reading to this back, just sitting here shuffling, waiting on you to find somewhere to go. And the minute you cut back, you go right into the wheel line back and hit you in the mouth. You know, that's the strength of what being aggressive at the defensive, uh, the defensive side can be. I can stand here all day long, as you guys can see. I got a muffin mouth when it comes to X's and O's. But that's just something simple as far as explaining the 3-4 under Coach Steele, explaining the 4-3, explaining the 3-3-5 stack under Coach Charlie Strong. Just a couple of things that they bring to bring to the table. As far as something simple against uh, stretch run, 
that 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 we'll see. So um, hopefully I didn't get too too far on there for you. 